Bran Castle in Transylvania is famous for spawning the original vampire legend of Dracula. Perched precariously on a rock high above a valley near Brasov in Romania, Bran Castle is open for business, cashing in on its nefarious reputation as Dracula's former abode. Here are seven amazing facts about Bran Castle in Transylvania. 1. The author of Dracula never actually visited the Transylvania castle. Irish author Bram Stoker invented Dracula as we know him today. The Count villain was the main character of Stoker's 1897 gothic horror novel, set in a vast and creepy castle perched high above a valley. Beneath the stone fortress, a river flowed past. Whether fact or fiction, its resemblance to Bran Castle is uncanny, notwithstanding the fact that Stoker never actually visited the castle. In fact, he never even set foot in Romania. 2. Vlad the Impaler, Count Dracula Stoker did, did look to history for some inspiration, however. Although Dracula is said to be entirely fictional, Stoker modeled the predator after a real-life villain, Vlad III Dracula, otherwise known as Vlad the Impaler or Vlad Dracula. And this bloodthirsty ruler of Wallachia did actually stay at Bran Castle, albeit only for a few months as a prisoner of the Hungarian army in the 15th century. 3. The locals believed in vampires. Romanian locals believed that Strigoi roamed the area after dark. These spirits rose from the dead and fed on their victims' blood. Sound familiar? As the story goes, the Strigoi were actually normal pe people during the day. Come nightfall, however, their souls left their sleeping bodies to torment their neighbors. 4. Real-life inhabitants of Bran Castle Who or what roams the castle after dark is anyone's guess. And in this case, the truth really is stranger than fiction. In 1920, the country's beloved Queen Marie of Romania received the castle as a gift. Queen Marie was the granddaughter of Queen Victoria and Romania's last queen consort. From 1920 to 1934, she lovingly restored and transformed the property into the royal family's summer residence. After Queen Marie's death, her daughter Princess Ileana inherited the castle. Queen Marie's final wish was that her heart be taken to Belchick Castle near the Black Sea and interred. But, her heart wandered for some time. Wars ensued and the territory changed hands. At first, Queen Marie's heart was moved to Bran Castle. When communism swept the country, custodians moved her heart once again. At last, her heart found its resting place at Pelisar Castle in Romania's Sinai region. 5. A Hospital for the Sick and Wounded During World War II, Princess Ileana put the extensive property to good use. The, prin the princess was a qualified nurse and used the castle as a hospital to treat wounded soldiers. 6. There is a secret passage Surely it's not a castle unless it has a secret passage? And Bran Castle certainly doesn't disappoint with a secret passage connecting the first and third floors. Initially, no one knew the passage even existed. When Queen Marie decided the castle's 57 rooms needed a refurb, so renovators moved an old fireplace. And hey presto, they unearthed a secret passage. 7. Bran Castle Transylvania is a modern-day Romanian landmark. The castle's most famous resident may be a figment of the imagination, we hope, but the Dracula legend certainly has done wonders for Romania's tourism. Not only is Bran Castle a treasured national monument, but it was also the country's first private museum, displaying art, artifacts, weapons and costumes from its long history. Feed your imagination with a visit to Bran Castle in Transylvania. Shrouded in dark myths, its thick fortress walls have seen dark days and the love of a queen. Walking through its cobblestone courtyards is a walk through centuries of history, from its founding by the Teutonic Knights in the 13th century to its 20th century introduction as a tourism hotspot.